up my Vina loves? It's Miss Vina D coming to you all from Vina Team at News Child. I don't know what's going on. I don't know who was eager, okay? Just excited, couldn't wait. They just wanted to release something. I don't know if somebody over there have it in for some of the ladies. I don't know what's going on. But this cast photo that was released is a hot mess. A hot mess. I mean, even Portia dress have a discoloration situation going on. Cynthia Bailey, who we already know is drop there, gorgeous. Face just look weird. I mean, Candy looks stunning. She's standing like a boss. Like, everything is great. Eva, yeah, it's okay. Portia is hanging in there. But I know one person who is not happy right now. And I'm sure she's been on the phone checking people. It's Nene. I mean, you guys already know, I'm a nice person. I don't go in on people's looks and all of that. So I'm not going in. I'm not doing that. I don't body shame people. I'm just critiquing the picture and trying to figure out who was just so, like, in a rush to release it. Now, I'm not saying these ladies need Photoshop. That's not what I'm getting to. What I'm saying is, if you're going to release professional work, something that's supposed to promote a show, especially the brand new season, then you want to release polished work. For example, if you're going to release something that's supposed to get people excited and be like, yes, snatch and all of that, then you want to release your best work. So that's why I'm saying somebody over there got got it in for some of the ladies especially nini i know nini is not going to be happy because nini every single day every single day she have to go through and this is not cool at all i don't condone this at all every single day she's going through you know cyber bullying the people you know coming for her for her overly photoshopping her pictures the face tone like they're coming for her like, oh my gosh, you doing too much surgery. All of these things, I'm not making them up. If you go ahead and watch some of my videos that I did on Nini, you will see them in there. I've actually, you know, posted videos 100% that was just on Nini clapping back at people coming for her looks. So Nini don't play that. She doesn't care either way because there are times where she will post pictures or go on Instagram live with no makeup, no nothing. And then there are times where she will post pictures where she's just all, you know, dolled up and things like that. But Nini is not going to be happy with this because for one, if you look on the picture, you see her skin is popping out of the dress. One side of her boobs is sitting the other one, it's just a mess. And then Cynthia Bailey face. I'm telling you this right now. They, they're going to release <laughs> the edited version. And it's going to look great, right? But I'm telling you, this season is already starting with drama from behind the scenes. Because I know old girl was on the phone when she saw these pictures like what the heck is going on i know portia's dress even if the material changes color and all of that i know there's no way this is the final cut there's no way there's this just no way candy balls like it's not even me being biased. You guys already know I'm here for Cynthia Bailey, you know, and all of that. She's gorgeous. And I'm even talking about the way how she looks. Now, let me do a close-up, okay? Let me post some close-up images so you can see because the one I had on the screen was just too far away. So these are the close-ups so you can really see what I'm talking about. Like, what? Look at Portia dress. My point. Now, who hand is that? Something look off in these pictures. Okay. Somebody did some photoshopping and filtering and something. Portia is engaged. Look at Portia's hand. First of all, you know, the rumor has been flying that Portia is pregnant. We'll see. So I guess, I, yeah, I don't think, it, it just looks weird. It looks like yeah this can't be it 
or maybe <laughs> look at the hand let me zoom <laughs> let me zoom look at her look at her hand yeah somebody don't like the ladies like somebody just wanted to start drama first of all yeah this is not it i'm gonna wait for the final but you know these are just the ladies this is a cast so let's just talk about the cast okay and not even focus on the picture because you know shamari or her name the girl from the singing group black and ronnie duvall wife um you know her hands her fingers some of the nine and a half nails Portia hands look like it was just placed there. She have a ring on it. So I guess she have an announcement to make. Okay, that she's engaged. Tanya. Uh, look at Cynthia. I mean, you know Nini is hot right now. Like, hot right now. She is not happy. Wow. Mm, 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 mm. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I mean, look at look at the arms crossing. This can't be it. This is not it. Someone is just being messy. You know, for one, people are saying, first of all, why would Bravo put the new girl in the middle, okay, next to Nini, and put Candy, Portia, and Cynthia, who's been there forever? on the side so you already know production or whoever you know somebody ain't fired <laughs> this is not the original cast photo yeah yeah I, I refuse to believe it they got too much money especially with kenya moore being gone you know that's why that's why they were able to go to japan because they took the million and some that they paid kenya and not able to pay all of these extra girls plus take a trip to japan i mean they had all of that left over <laughs> you know what i'm saying so yeah but yeah i refuse to believe <laughs> that this is the fauna cut absolutely not and i know that once the fauna image is released the girls will go ahead and and post them but no that that is not it you know, and like I said, I'm not going to waste anyone's time by posting um, the comment session. And I mean, it's the same old, different day. Nothing changed. You know, West Kenya, West Kenya, West Kenya. Same old, different day. So, yeah, it's not going to change. <laughs> Milo reaches for a peach producers. <laughs> That's stupid. I don't think Milo wants a peach. What the heck is this? Kenny looks cool. Exactly. Kenny, I said it. Not feeling it. We need Kenny and Sherry back in sap. Sherry thinks she's slick. She ain't come back because it is September. It's spring summer. <laughs> I already told you to keep it. We want Kenny <laughs> comments. But let me get out of these comments. Speaking of Sheree, let me go to mine. <laughs> my instagram page so a few days ago i posted this image <laughs> y'all need to leave sheree alone i posted i posted these beautiful images of sheree right on her page and she posted out celebrating birthday well her friend she tagged her friend birthday this weekend and this person wrote you out celebrating but we're trying to figure out where the chargers access because it's september spring summer i know some of you might be like okay okay vina is is late it's old it's dry we get it the dragon situation was funny the first time it's still funny to me so i'm still going to laugh um where are the joggers, Sheree? Inquiry minds would like to know. I have <laughs> lifestyle needs, mama. So you can already see people still being messy. They are not leaving Sheree alone, okay? But yeah, someone is getting fired. Somebody is in trouble. Like, that right there was just a terrible move. But with all of that being said, uh, I was going to talk about Milo. Milo... Um, Mala is in almost every single episode. Okay, so you're trying to tell me I can be in every single episode. I don't have to show my love life. Okay, 
and I've been on this show for all of these years and I am as first I am as famous and as popular as the top girls sure sign me up this extra check will be nice so that's it a friend of the show it's not required okay to bring a man through just there's no pressure so Milo can still do her thing behind closed doors because her lifestyle allegedly you know she's not going to be showing the people she's doing her thing with you got you guys heard what Kenya said Kenya's my girl I love her but you know she really went in on Milo I'm not going to repeat some of the things <laughs> you know she said but yeah so Milo had the perfect situation like yes I can keep that peach because I'm good. I already got money. The stuff that I have is already paid for by my dudes. You know, this extra check is good for me. And Milo is chilling. So for the people saying, my God, Milo, still ain't getting a peach yet. And laughing. I think Milo loves her situation with the Red House of Atlanta. Because she doesn't really have to do as much work. You know, but she's in. she still managed to be in every single episode managed to go on every cast trip for free the trips are free and she had the perfect situation um eva looks great in a picture um you guys i already introduced tanya a little while ago the new wife i guess she went ahead and you know because it was rumors that you know because of her family her husband her job and everything she had going on she did not want to be full-time but it looked like bravo presented her an offer that she couldn't refuse so she's going to be full-time so you have seven housewives okay okay let me just say the part that i just explained that there's no way under no circumstances that this was the original cast photo and that someone is getting fired i was exactly right and i'm glad that i didn't upload that video yet yes i could have come back as this being a pat a part two but since the video is not uploaded yet i was right and nini I, I knew it there's no way nini leaks of all people the mother of photoshop no shade this is no shade there's nothing wrong with airbrushing and fixing your picture especially if it's a professional polish shoot there's nothing wrong with putting your best foot forward you know what i'm saying now you're chilling in the backyard all that stuff post whatever my thing is even when nini is chilling in the backyard whatever her pictures look like someone don't smooth it and do all of those things and like i said there's nothing wrong with that if you want to put your best foot forward do you you know what i'm saying i'm not here to judge people and tell them how to do their pictures but nini you go on her page and you see nini is the queen of retouching her pictures so there's no way she was going to approve a picture of you know skin hanging out of her dress and all of that now what this did though is basically show the reality the reality of things is it's okay it's okay nini like if you know that area of your body that's what it is and that's what it is like embrace yourself be happy because that area of your body wasn't touched so that's the original picture this is the retouch picture by nini leaks right here so she posted this image right here and of course she had a thing or two to say about production all right it sucks to have leaked it sucks to have a leaked cast photo out there that doesn't represent some of us in the best light funny how this only happens with the real house of atlanta cast just know that this is not the official cast photo soon come all right child you know the internet don't care <laughs> this person wrote nini actually means the cast photo is at production patiently waiting for the airbrush and photoshop and filters to be completed uh exactly so what is she mad at her own picture yeah now nah, girl you knew good and well you looked like a female bodybuilder in the shining dress yet you still let them take a picture of you don't blame you know what you know what 
I'm not even going to laugh because like I said, I'm not here to body shame anybody. She's mad. She mad because after all that surgery, she's still, she's still as white as a linebacker. You see, 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 mm -mm. not today, not today sitting. Nope. Nope. Not on this good old Sunday. Mm -mm. I'm not going to hell with you guys. Nope. Not doing it. She triggered because the pic doesn't have all the Photoshop she is used to. Exactly. She mad because she looked fat in the pics, no filter. I'm not a fan of this new face of hers, but that's my opinion. She's pissed because she was not in the middle. That's why. It have nothing to do with in the middle. It have everything to do with. I'm telling you, like, if you're going to present a work, that this is the new season Kenya Moore is gone like we're gonna revamp it of course you want the best foot polish like the ladies come out looking snatches like yes I know Kenya is not there whatever and it's sad but I can't wait not me I'm saying like people reaction those who want to you know move on and be excited for the franchise even though they're mad that certain key players are no longer there because like I said, I wasn't going to get into the comments about Kenya not being there, but it's flooded with, I can't believe it's, it's real. It's, it's really real. Kenya Moore is gone, you know, and people are feeling the impact. So they were just ready to be all types of happy, you know, with this new cast picture. And then this happened. I mean, let's take a trip. You know what? Let's take a trip and let's go to Nene Page. Thing, the only part where I um, see why she's upset and where she's coming from, excluding the Photoshop and all of that, is the part where she feels like even though the Real Housewives of Atlanta bring in the most ratings, they're not respected. And that's why every single video I've done since Kenya Moore departure, I've been applauding her and I've been saying even though Bravo would never publicly admit it, they will forever respect that woman because she wasn't willing to bow down to them and take whatever chump change they were throwing her just because they feel the black girls are desperate and just when cameras in their face she walked away and no oh, i'm gonna go ahead and do my own thing and she will forever be respected for that you are not about to sit here all right and watch me show my husband show my child show everything and then pay me like less than what you know someone else who's on a show as a friend is making up because i ran off and got married not today you know bye bye i quit and the real house of atlanta ladies um their franchise is the highest rated and some of them don't even make close to what the white girls make and that's where she's coming from how come the the leaks and all of these different things don't happen to the white cast but it always happens to the brown girls you know let's put the race in it that's that's where she's going with it but you want to go ahead and end it here my vina loves i am wishing you all an amazing day thank you all for the love and support if you're not subscribed to the channel go ahead and subscribe to the channel go ahead and leave this video a thumbs up also turn your notifications so when i post you're aware that i post it and i will see you all in the comment session remember to always have the god bless attitude which is being positive at all times and seeing the good in every situation and even this image right here that a regular person took looks better than the cast photo all right i'm done <laughs> god bless <laughs> Bye bye